Hey guys, Neil I from Engadget. We're here in the Sony booth uh, right after the presser at CS 2011. Uh, we have the Sony Ericsson Xperia Arc here. Uh, as you can see, it's super thin. Um, you can compare it next to, say, an iPhone 4, uh, much thinner. Uh, I got a Droid X here. Uh, about the same, there's no, there's no hump right there. Um, but really the big feature here besides the thinness uh, is what Sony Ericsson is calling the reality display, which is pretty cute. You can unlock it here. Uh, you can see it's super high pixel density. We've got to get the exact resolution. Uh, and you can turn the Bravia engine on and off here. Uh, and the Sony says this is going to dramatically improve image quality, color saturation, stuff like that on this phone. Uh, besides that, you know, it's very much Sony Ericsson's skin on Android. Uh, performance is a little jittery, I'm noticing. It's pretty good, but it's not perfect. Obviously, it's an early piece of hardware, early piece of software. It's going to ship Q1 this year. They have announced carriers, have announced price, so we'll have to find that out. But I think the bigger question for Sony Ericsson is going to be, uh, will they be able to keep this phone up with Android? Obviously, they've had a hard time with the Xperia X10. Um, you know, if they can keep hardware like this up with Android itself, I think people are going to be much more attracted, especially because it's a really beautiful piece of hardware. And obviously, the other question we have is, please God, where is the PlayStation phone? Uh, hopefully, we'll find out more about that somewhere at the show. We'll corral somebody and demand that they tell us. But for now, here's the Sony Ericsson Xperia Arc. It's pretty beautiful. And we're at Sony CS 2011.